Hi, I'm Glenda Bostock with Mission Vietnam and Blast Off Music Ministries. Today we're in the studio because we want to take you to a special little village outside of Cameron Bay, Vietnam. This little village reminds me of the passage in Matthew chapter 9. Then Jesus went about all the cities and villages, teaching in their synagogues, preaching the gospel of the kingdom and healing every sickness and every disease among the people. But when he saw the multitudes, he was moved with compassion for them, because they were weary and scattered like sheep having no shepherd. Then he said to his disciples, The harvest truly is plentiful, but the laborers are few. Therefore, pray the Lord of the harvest to send out laborers into his harvest. The mission of Mission Vietnam was birthed in the heart of evangelist Dave Reaver, who was injured many years ago in this country. Dave says it well when he said, let's not ask God to come bless what we're doing. Let's ask God where he wants us to go to do what he's doing. This is his harvest. Every Sunday, there's over 150 people that come to this church. We were just listening to the pastor, and he has a soul-winning heart. He says each day he brings five souls to the Lord Jesus Christ. Mỗi lần mới giúp người ta một câu này để giúp cho thanh biết chúng ta không còn nợ ma quỷ nữa. So that's why I give them this verse. I would like to let them know that we don't owe anything for the devil from now on. Chúng ta có Giêsu là đủ rồi. We have a Jesus. That's yes. enough. Right now, we're looking at a church that only costs five thousand dollars to build, so that hundreds of people could come to the Lord Jesus Christ. You can help us by planting seeds and reaching souls for the kingdom of Jesus Christ by just pouring a seed financially to help us build little churches like this all over this country. It's such a pleasure to be able to come to where we have participated in uh, the assistance with the church. We're here with these children today to see and love on them and uh, sit in their classrooms. And uh, it's such an honor to be here to see how they praise the Lord in their language and uh, pretty much you follow the songs by the sound of the tune. Uh, we really love doing this or else we wouldn't be here. This is our calling on a lot of its lives. You know, we've lived our first life fighting. We're living the second life loving. What an awesome thing what we're experiencing in Vietnam. Things that we've been praying for now for 12 years is happening right now before our eyes in Vietnam. We're seeing the church move forward uh, like we've never seen before. It's been worth the wait uh, the past 12 years that we've prayed and, and sacrificed time uh, coming to Vietnam and doing the work that we're doing here. Uh, I saw these children today and all of them were in Bible study this morning uh, in the church. And I thought, my, what an investment we can make in America if we could just see the vision or get the vision and, and ride along with us with this team from Mission Vietnam. May God bless you. Thank you so much for supporting Mission Vietnam. This is what it's all about.